Laverne and Shirley, brought to you by Burger King, where you get the burger you want the way you want it. America loves burgers, and we're America's Burger King. Still, the daily medicine treatment, that's what some modern teens have learned to do about blemishes. Now, as you know, the Batman arrived here on ABC last week, and uh, this is kind of a strange and wonderful new concept in television. It's new but old. It's uh, the comic strips come back in live action, and in a second, we'll get another glimpse of the Batman. Charles? Right you are, Dick. The next portion of American Bandstand is brought to you by delicious dentine chewing gum, by new arid spray deodorant, to be sure, and by Dr. Pepper, the distinctively different soft drink. Uh, now, you were talking about Batman. Yes, zap, howie, bop, bingo. All right, Charlie. Now, if, uh, let's see, those of you here in the studio, you'll have to, I guess, look over here or up on the wall, wherever the monitors are. You stay right where you are because the Batman is coming one time. <laughs> Here they come. Batman and Robin, intrepid pursuers of evil, fearless warriors against crime. <laughs> of a lifetime. You have it until you've seen The Batman here on ABC, part of the second season. Premiering Wednesday, Beyond Westworld. The question, how do you kill a man who may be a machine? A scientific genius has built human-like robots programmed to endanger the world. He's planted a robot on a nuclear sub. The mission, locate and destroy it. Watch Beyond Westworld. Premiering Wednesday at 8, 7 Central. Tuesday on Three's Company. It's fun in the woods. Now I'm never going to get any sleep. And games in the tent. How cozy. Then on Taxi. Get on. Elaine is the prize when Louie and Alex battle it out. Should we shake on it? To see who's king of the cabbies. <laughs> then on Heart to Heart. Prostitution's a very dangerous way of making a living. Jennifer poses as a hardcore lady of the night to help Jonathan bait a killer. Heart to Heart. Wednesday, it's the Lady Anglers, the man who washes money, a rodeo with convict cowboys, life at a military school, and suicide skiing all on real people. Then Arnold takes up karate to go chop-chop on a bully. May a dragonfly never find a home in your underwear. Different strokes, and Larry's dad socks it to Larry. Your mother wanted a girl. Then movies is the theme. The Pepsi syndrome. On the best of Saturday Night Live. I don't get to do this every day. NBC Smash Night of Comedy, Wednesday. Wednesday on 8 is Enough. It's a two-hour special, and you're invited to join the Bradfords for a crazy and unforgettable family reunion in sunny Hawaii, where everybody picks up some cool action on the warm sand. Then Charlie's Angels hit the streets hot at a special time, 10, 9 Central and Mountain. We're very good at what we do. And learn some tricks no angel has ever dared. Richie and Fonzie get the farmer's daughter in trouble. You too are going to marry my girl. It's Laverne and Shirley on the season premiere of Happy Days. Then it's the season premiere of Angie. Nice going, Princess Big Mouth. Her old friends think she's become a snob. So you're Chrissy. I am. And Three's Company's back when Jack goes undercover. And on the season premiere of Taxi, Louie's in love. How much pleasure can one man endure? Tuesday, starting at 8, 7 Central and Mountain on ABC. Do you know where bus stop is? Where strangers pass in the night or meet for a brief interlude? The result can be a savage conflict or a tender moment. Bus stop brings to your television screen the force and power of unforgettable human drama in one of the most outstanding programs of this or any year. Explain this whole thing to me. I have no intention of explaining anything to you, Sheriff. In 10 minutes, I can have my governor on the phone. The stories you will see on Bus Stop explore every level of life, the warmth 
and the terror that springs from the restless multitudes, always pressing on to the next city on the map. Bust Up, adult entertainment, outstandingly produced. Bust Up, every week on ABC TV. Friday, they're back. Television's hottest stars going for all the action and glory in the Battle of the Network Stars. It's Christmas from Nashville with Robert Urich and everybody's favorite country music stars. Christmas from the Grand Ole Opry. Saturday, the Ropers move in with the neighbors and Jeffrey's love life goes down in smoke. You mean you don't want me? Maybe never again. Then the detective school sets the bait for a killer stalking a panty fashion show. Take it out! On Detective School. Tomorrow. Next Sunday, start your day with NFL 79. Then it's regional coverage of exciting NFL action. Telecasts include the Patriots Bengals battle and the Oakland Seattle Clash. Check local listings for the game in your area. NBC Sports. We're proud. This is the campus of Channing College, a progressive institution of higher learning, or if you will, a modern coliseum where they throw live teachers to the students. Joe Howe there is one of our livelier specimens, young enough to offer his students friendship as well as facts. And Joe's old enough to know better. An honesty in the world, afraid of a little campus gossip. Lori. Oh. Now, Lori, let no, me tell me. me. When I went into that room to vote, sure, I thought about us. Joe Howe is a combination of many people. He's father confessor, traffic cop, secret passion, and his life is never, but never dull. Oh, smile, Joe, or I might think that faraway look in your eyes means another woman. Joe, what I'm trying to caution you against is getting involved. Look for the Nancy Walker Show, new this fall on ABC. Friday, Arnold asks about the birds, the bees, and... About babies. Wait a minute, come back! Was it something I said? Then, Ruthie sets up a romantic evening for Larry and her mom. Wearing your pajamas, Larry. But Morgan breaks the spell. Hello, Larry. Next, Jim goes into the world of rock and roll and finds murder and music don't mix. Then... Eyeshide is back. You got a new kind of heroin problem. And he defies Uncle Sam when he busts a drug ring working for the U.N. Comedy in action Friday on NBC. Here's ABC's primetime package. First, the winners are back. When you're the $6 million man, you better live up to your name. Lee Majors is the $6 million man. I don't care if you eat burritos or bagels or French toast. If you're bad, I'm going to bust you. Robert Blake is Beretta. When you're this cool, they're out to get you. You call them memories. We call them happy days. You're cool. Whoa, are you cool? <laughs> no, Cheryl. I think I'd do anything for you. Laverne and Shirley do for each other what they wouldn't do for themselves. You do it. <laughs> Starsky and Hutch don't crack a case. They take it apart. Man, we're talking about lives. Lives, man. <laughs> Starsky and Hutch. She's worth a fortune, and everybody wants some of the action. If you wanted to kill me, wouldn't I be dead by now? She's a bionic woman. In Cotter's class, you mentioned learning. They'll change the subject. Mr. Cotter, your students are somewhat offbeat. Welcome back, Cotter. Get down! Lieutenant Mike Stone's a cop you can trust. All right, I kept my end of the bargain. I'll keep yours. Richard Hatch joins Carl Malden on the streets of San Francisco. There's something new. There's something young. There's something else. They're Donnie and Marie. The craziest things happen in the 12th precinct. Just the time we've been gone. Stick up, two muggings, breaking and entering. Why don't we just raise a white flag over the building? Donnie Miller. Hailed as a triumph of contemporary drama. Family. Nancy, if you go, it won't solve anything. Nancy! How do you imagine you'd feel if you came home and you found your husband was sleeping? I don't have to imagine. I know. Exploring the complexities of modern life 
with honesty and compassion. Lloyd, I'm growing up and I need you to help. How can I help you grow up? And as I grow up myself. We're a family, for God's sake. We'll make it work. Facing it together. Family. And this fall, the biggest motion picture in the history of television continues. Rich Man, Poor Man, nominated for 23 Emmy Awards, is in a class by itself. Its characters, its love, its excitement return in Rich Man, Poor Man, book two. I'm accusing you of seducing my daughter. You let some other poor slob make you a rich man. I have had it. This fall, ABC's critically acclaimed concept continues with Rich Man, Poor Man, book two. They tell me that you're one of the richest, the, the richest man in the world. Well, the world, that, that's pretty big. Well, then, let's just say America. Let's leave it the world. <laughs> okay, Crackerby, let's make her alive. That other fellow is called Sinjin Quincy. He don't know it yet, but he's going to bust my kid straight through into high altitude society. Mr. Crackerby, I am broke. I haven't accomplished very much in my life. But I feel I would have justified my existence. If I can be the one man in the world who turned down a chance to be purchased by O.K. Crackerby. You know what I like about that boy? He thinks he won that round. Watch the fun on O.K. Crackerby starting Thursday night, September 16th, right here on ABC. Wonder Woman leads off the action and meets the Falcon, whose secret weapon is earthquakes. Then, Starsky and Hutch call her a tough and troubled 12-year-old bandit. And the most wanted is a beautiful face hiding the heart of a murderess. Right after Wonder Woman and Starsky and Hutch. Saturday on ABC. Everyone, you